After booking my trip to Japan, the first thing I know I wanted to do is to have a family photo shoot with our kimonos. And I found this deal on Kluk. We are a family of nine, so we booked our appointment ahead of time. The prices ranges from as low as $15 to $80. And the kimono package comes with a bag, slippers, hair styling, and hair accessories. Unfortunately, they don't have any kimonos for infants, but they do have some for children. It was actually hard to choose what kimono to wear because they have a lot of choices. Plus, I wanted it to match with my accessories and I wanted to get this kimono but my sister told me it doesn't look like a traditional kimono so I went ahead and picked this kimono with this matching bag. There were only two of them at the shop but they were friendly and professional and I advise to come in early if you're a big family like ours and they also speak English if you're wondering. After choosing what kimonos to wear, the staff helped us to get dressed, then they asked us to choose what hairstyle we wanted and some hair accessories to go with it. Of course, my mom had to be the first because she told us this is her dream and it's kinda sad because my dad is not here with us. And they actually did good on our hairstyles. Here's my mom's, my sister, my niece, and here's mine. And they also have kimonos for men and it's a bit pricey compared to ours since the quality and the fabric is different. But here's my younger and older brother with their kimonos. And now it's time for our kimono fit check. Here's mine and I choose this blue and pink kimono with the matching gold and pink purse. And here's my mom's and she also picked this blue and pink kimono. We were having so much fun at the moment as you can see. My little sister opted for this pink kimono to go with my niece's kimono. My kuya or my older brother in Tagalog looked so snappy in this kimono while my little brother chose this green kimono. I didn't get the chance to take a video of my niece's and nephew's kimonos but here's a video. We're walking the streets of Osaka because we're on our way to the location of our photo shoot. I I paid about $150 for the photo shoot and the location they suggested was inside the zoo and it's a bit crowded that day so I suggest doing your own research when it comes to your location. All in all, we had so much fun and our photos came in great. I will post a separate video for our photos and if you have any questions about our kimono photo shoot experience, comment down below.